This video is going to talk about multiplying and dividing integers. The rule is actually the exact same whether you're multiplying or dividing integers. What you have to remember is that if there are no negative signs, your answer is going to be positive. You've been doing that your whole life. If there are two negative signs, one negative sign, two negative signs, you're actually going to combine those two negative signs. They actually end up, one negative sign is down here, and then the other negative sign flips to become, and they join up to become a positive sign. So two negatives make a positive. Doesn't work in real life, two wrongs don't make a right, but in integers, two negatives do make a positive. If you have one integer who's all alone and is kind of getting lonely, what you do is you give that negative sign to the answer. That way he's got a friend and he'll be happy too. Let's look at some problems. If we have negative 4 times positive 6, the first thing that we're going to do is multiply like normal. 6 times 4 is 24. Now we have to figure out what sign should this be. We only have one negative sign. And because we only have one negative sign, what's going to happen is that negative sign is going to go over to the 24. So our answer is going to be negative 24. This doesn't count because it's a positive sign. So it's important to look at the sign, but make sure you're only counting the number of negative signs. Another problem, negative 3 times negative 2. First thing you do is you just multiply like normal. 3 times 2 is 6. Now what you're going to do, we have two negative signs. Two negatives make a positive, so our answer is going to be positive 6. Now let's say that we have a division problem. Let's say that we have positive 9 divided by negative 3. Well, let's do our basic math first. 9 divided by 3 is 3, and then we're going to look at the signs. We have a positive sign, which doesn't count, and a negative sign. One negative sign means that our answer is going to be negative, because that negative sign is very lonely, so we're going to attach it to the answer. And then division, if we have negative 12 divided by negative 4, first thing we do is we perform the problem like normal. 12 divided by 4 is 3. We have two negative signs. They're going to join up. They're going to be very happy together. So our answer is going to be positive. 